I think my favorite review is from San Francisco when they said Liberace was no Rubenstein. But then Rubenstein is no Liberace. <laughs> oh, this is my houseboy, Carlucci. He rules the roost around here. Thank you. Pig? What? Pig in a blanket. You want a pig in a blanket? Huh? No. Thanks. See, I don't get it. Were my instructions this morning unclear? Sir, if Nick wasn't there to talk the kid down, I'd be dead right now. And I appreciate that. But it doesn't change the situation. He held me hostage at gunpoint. And you neglected to report it. And then you swapped a service bullet to hide the fact that he had overpowered you and that you had fired your weapon. Look, that was a mistake. And I'm good to face the consequences. But we need to get this kid off the street, plain and simple. You're right. He should be off the street. And the both of you should be under indictment for obstruction of justice. But you know what? Neither one of those things are going to happen if I have anything to do with it. You two are very lucky that the commander here is going to go to bat for you. You're going to book the kid on simple possession, and then this whole Pandora's box of shit stays closed. He'll be back on the street in a week. Probably less. And the two of you can share credit for now. Get the fuck out of my office! So, all you boys are gonna need some cash up front, right? So each one of you will be given a small portion of our product to sell just for yourselves. Whatever profits you make is yours to keep. Good deal? Yeah. Yeah, that sounds awesome, man. You never have to worry about money again. As long as you follow my three rules. Number one, keep your mouth shut about our plans. Number two, have a loose control. Number three, no one at this table uses our product. Ever. Break any of my rules. And I kill you. So, who's ready for dessert? I could end you, Senor Alman, like I have ended so many others. Emperors, noblemen, your blood would be little more than an insignificant drop in a vast red sea. Do you just kill yourself and start again? Is that the secret? There are endless secrets within secrets. None of which you have earned the right to know. Hmm? Best I keep an eye on you. Now, Hamlet, where's Polonius? Oh, at, uh, at supper. At supper? Where? Not where he eats, but where he is eaten. A certain convocation of politic worms is eating at him. See, your worm is your only emperor for diet. We fat all creatures else to fat us, and we fatten ourselves for maggots. Your fat king and your lean beggar is but variable service. Two dishes, but to one table. Alas, alas. You see, a man may fish with a worm that hath fed of a king and cut of a fish that hath fed of that worm. What dost thou mean by this? Nothing but to show you how a king may go progress through the guts of a beggar. Where is Polonius? In heaven. He made you a pesto panini. Oh. Did you, uh, did you bring my fresco? What? Here's what's gonna happen. You listening? You think you're so hot and sexy with your hard ass and that bisexual bullshit. You know how many there have been? Bobby, Hans, Chase, oh, and some country boy stripper who was so dumb he wore his G-string backwards. He got rid of all of them.
but I'm still here. And one day, Lee is going to call Seymour, and he's going to tell him to get rid of you. <laughs>